Your husband pleasured me as no other man. I'm glad to be on dry land. Just got off a cruise ship. I'm on cruise ships about 12 weeks out of the year. You guys go on cruises? It's fun. I love it. I don't get seasick. Some folks do, some don't. Last ship I'm on, I'm on the promenade deck about 9 o'clock one night. This man my age comes out. He doesn't say hello. What's your name? Where are you from? Having fun. He leans over the rail and gets as sick as I've ever seen a human being get. He bringing up breakfast from 1961, 72. I said, you ought to see the ship's doctor. He said, son, I am the ship's doctor. So I'm glad to be here. These cruise ships, when you get on them, all they are is shopping malls and casinos on the ocean. That's what a cruise ship is. And you've seen the gift shops. They're fabulous. Everything goes on sale at the end of the cruise. Last ship I'm on, 50% off fine jewelry sale. Great. I'll buy my wife a nice present, save some money to boot. I pick out a thousand dollar diamond pendant, going to look great on her. We go to check out. The lady behind the counter is having trouble figuring out the discount. I said, man, this is so simple. If I give you $1,000 minus 50%, how much did you take off? She thought a minute and said, everything but my earrings. <laughs> it's unbelievable. What they sell is watches. Every ship you ever go on has 100,000 watches for sale. You go on shore, a million watches for sale. Because they have so many, they're rather aggressive in peddling these watches. A man showed me a watch. He said it's water resistant to 10 atmospheres. I said, what's that mean in English? He said it's waterproof to 300 feet underwater. I said, mister, I'm a middle-aged man from Louisville, Kentucky. If I'm 300 feet underwater, I ain't checking a time. <laughs> Have you been to Mexico on a cruise ship? Unbelievable. They have a thing there called the fish spa. The fish spa. And here's what it is. You pay somebody 35 American dollars to sit at the edge of an aquarium and put your legs in their aquarium and their fish eat the dead skin cells off of your legs. You pay somebody $35 to feed their pet fish. Let me tell you something. If I'm in Mexico and I've paid somebody $35 to nibble my toes, it ain't going to be a goldfish, right? <laughs> but you have so much fun. The lady who ran our gift shop was from Romania. And she had the most beautiful Eastern European accent you ever heard in your life. And she was a beautiful woman to go along with all that. She came to the comedy show every night. And she would uh, bring her customers to come see the show. She did not speak English all that well, but her customers loved the show, and they'd buy more things from her the next day in the shop. So the next week, my wife gets on the ship with me, and she wanted to tell my wife how much she enjoyed my act. What she meant to say was, I enjoyed your husband's act best of all. What came out in that beautiful Eastern European accent sounded like this. Your husband pleasured me as no other man. <laughs> My wife goes, are you talking about him? <laughs> she goes, yes, when he finished, I have tears in my eyes. <laughs> my wife goes, yeah, that's him, all right, that's my guy.